Hey, Anna Louise, how are you this week? So I it's am, your turn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm absolutely buzzing. Thank you very much, Brenda. It's lovely to be here with you. I take it you're well, are you? I am fantastic. And mm -hmm. I really want to know what you've been up to. Wow. Well, I am, I am clearing my desk of something that's been on it and rolling around it for about five years now that I've been promising myself to do, promising others that I would do. And that is to take my experience, my 30 year experience in face reading and put it into an online course. So, wow. Big job. Face reading. Yeah. yeah. I've never heard of face reading. So tell me a little bit about Have it. Have you not? Okay. Never. <laughs> All right. Well, face reading is um, a tool that's part of Chinese medical um, philosophy, Chinese medical yeah. diagnosis. It goes back about 5,000 years and was originally um, a tool that the emperors would use to find out about people around them so that they could make better judgments and better decisions. But eventually it went into the Chinese medical practice. And yeah. what face reading does is it reads the features of your face. So your eyebrows, your eyes, your yeah. lips. So it's not about expression and it's yeah. not about, um, it's not about judgment or psychic anything yeah. even though it's called face reading the emphasis is that each element of your face is like a paragraph in a chapter in the story of you wow. so if, by interpreting each of them then what happens is you get an inner view heart yeah. body and soul so i'm writing this course and i've been wanting to do it for ages and finally finally i'm i'm doing it and um i'm really excited <laughs> And can you do this online? Like, can you do it with somebody who is, do they have to be present with you or can you do it? Like, nope. could we try it out? <laughs> <laughs> could we well, try it out? It can, listen, I use it every day. I have done for 30 yeah. years. So I've built up a real, you know, Wow. bundle of information definitely can be done live it's brilliant for therapists because they can use this skill just as an observation skill while they're speaking with their clients so they can see yes. extra things that add to the story add to the consultation that they're, they're having with their clients Amazing. so they can give them better treatments can do it live i can do this with you now um oh, I can do it with as well Very go on sorry. then okay <laughs> So I'm willing. You'll have to tell me what I have to do. Have I to go like up close to the camera? Or? No, you're good. You're good. I can see this. I'm, listen, I can face read at a glance these days. So, okay. Uh, okay. Well, look, let's start with something that everybody thinks, um, you know, that is just nothing on their face, and that's their eyebrows. Now, mm. I know that we all, or us women, like to groom our eyebrows underneath, but it's actually the top line that that is red. So, if I, if I'm looking at your eyebrows, what I see is a nice arch and and it's not really super arch like a rainbow, but it's got a good gentle arch. And that tells me that you're quite open-minded, quite spiritually minded, that you do like to explore things instead of just saying, no, everything's black and white, not, not considering wow. the options. You're, you're rainbow minded, shall we say. Is that you? Yeah, that would be me. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Okay. What I would also say, let me do, let me just do a couple more for you. Um, what I would also say is that you're actually quite a private person, um, that you you like to listen to other people's story, that you you will sit and care for or listen to other people endlessly. But when people want to turn the conversation to ask about you, you might give a little bit out, but then you quickly turn it back around away from you. It's not that you're avoiding, it's just that your emphasis is outwardly rather than inwardly when you're with oh. other people. Does that wow. make sense? That, that would make sense, yeah. That okay. would be very... Um, one final thing, I would say that you're an incredibly generous person, that you're very heart centered, that you can tend to let your money fritter away from you a little bit too quickly <laughs> at times. So it's so accurate. Um, oh my God. <laughs> but it's not necessarily that you're rampantly crazy with your money. It's just that if you will be super generous at Christmas and birthdays for other people. You will treat yourself occasionally, but only when everybody else's needs are met type thing. Um, and that, that's telling, your nose is telling me that basically. <laughs> that is so me. I just love spending money. <laughs> <laughs> brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. So yeah, that's just, that is fascinating. It's really fascinating. Brilliant. Well, the thing yeah. is that I love doing face reading because everybody's face is different obviously yeah. but the interpretations and how it all fits together uh, the view of the whole person is what makes it really valuable 
yeah. Wow. So, and when is the online course going out? Well, I have a big interview with uh, the British Complementary Medicine Association, a webinar on the 1st of November, um, and I'll put the link in my Facebook page. Um, yeah, I do. And that way anybody can join up. So it's free webinar, 1st of November, 8 p.m. Um, so that the course is going to be ready on or around then. Um, I'll mm -hmm. certainly be taking pre-registration interest and I'm just looking forward to getting it online. So I'm also looking forward to some volunteer faces. So if anybody wants to send me a message or <laughs> send me along, I would love to do um, some volunteer faces for my face reading course, just to add to the reality of it all. So, so well, yeah. I think that is just amazing. And Brilliant. I'll put the link on my page too, because it's it's fabulous. It's fascinating. Brilliant. Thank you. Well, therapists find it brilliant, as well as any other profession where you're aiming to manage, help, or yeah. heal people. Yeah. It's brilliant. And it, you know what? It's a brilliant self-knowing tool as well. So yeah. as you're learning, you're understanding yourself better, which means you can know more about your soul path, about your what's going on with your health, and also look inside that kind of inner you and, and really start to galvanize that into complete sparkliness. So, Oh, I'm... I've got to sign up, I think. Brilliant. 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 Well, Definitely go to the webinar. Gosh, it's amazing. It sounds fascinating. Well, the thing is, you know, when I've done magazine articles in the past, and I've been asked for various magazines to do features and such, yeah. they've always said, find some faces and, and interpret them for us. And I've always said, well, look, let's go one better than that. Why don't you provide me with the faces? Clearly, I don't know these people. Yes. I'll do a face reading from it then get them to tell you how accurate it is. If, you, if it's rubbish, we won't use it. But every single one that's ever presented a face has always been used because it's accurate. So, yeah, I love wow. it. It's that such is... a brilliant tool. Well, listen, best of luck with that. Thank and, you. Uh, share the link. We'll share the links around. Cheers. Thank you. Listen, so much. Have a great to hear about that. Have a great week. Well, you too. And I really look forward to next time. Yeah. Fabulous. Thanks very much. Okay. Cheers. Bye. Bye. Bye.